Welcome to Knock Pro Nation. Welcome back guys, Jarrell here. And I'm Josh. And ladies and gentlemen, today we have an amazing theory of a possible Michonne exit. How are they going to do Michonne's exit from The Walking Dead? I think we just might have or be on to something. Yeah, guys. So this isn't anything from any articles that we've seen, any rumors from any other YouTubers or any commenters. This is something that Josh texted me through our messaging that I was like... Yeah. It could work. Okay. It could work. work. Yeah. It, could, it could definitely work. <laughs> so, guys, this does tie in with Maggie and her possible return earlier than expected because initially we reported that Maggie w definitely was returning back to The Walking Dead. They did make an agreement on her returning, but it wouldn't be until season 11. Most recently, Angela Kang just released that, yes, Maggie will be returning, but one season earlier she'll be returning in season 10 later in season 10. late season 10 yeah. yes so we have yet to receive any information on how amc and the walking dead is going to do michonne's exit and mm. right now with four or five episodes in we have gotten none no mention of michonne's exit which leads us to believe that they are going to hold this off until the second half of season 10 yeah we've got a few commenters that, that has mentioned um they've probably gotten it from maybe other spoiler sites that kind of you know give that information out from what they may know um i've heard maybe episode 12 around something yeah. like that so definitely in the second half so. now with that said maggie is currently with georgie and she's mm -hmm. going to be returning from G being out with georgie now, my theory is that obviously she's with Georgie. Georgie is around. We don't know. We don't what, know. We don't know Georgie's, Georgie's backstory. First yeah. of all, but because what we know, sorry, we know that Oceanside mm -hmm. is able to go to a specific area to pick up letters. Now, I think they had to take a boat for that. Yeah. So it's quite far. We we still haven't seen the landscape of where Oceanside has to go, but they have to take a boat to a certain spot to get these letters. Yeah. So, but what we do know is Georgie's purpose. Georgie's purpose mm -hmm. is finding communities and telling them or educating them on how to survive, giving them survival tactics. Mm -hmm. She gave Maggie an entire book on how to build a civilization. A windmill. Exactly. <laughs> so we're led to believe that Georgie has probably ran into her fair share of communities. Mm -hmm. Now, my theory is that Georgie and Maggie, while they've been out this whole time, have heard about a gentleman who was t rescued at a bank, a river bank, with a serious wound to the side. Mm -hmm. Now, my theory is that Maggie will mention this to Michonne, maybe not even knowing yet about Rick, and that will be Michonne's aha light bulb moment that she needs to go find Rick. Yeah, that could work. Because, you know, that that's our biggest thing, is that we don't believe Michonne is going to be killed. No way. There's no confirmation that, you know, Denai Guerrero is going to be in the Rick movies. They're not going to give that information out right now. Because it probably won't even be until the second or third movie, if they do it. But they... There has to be a way for her to leave. Now, there, we've, we've mentioned before, like, maybe she finds out... She leaves Judith and RJ with the people that she trusts because it's a very dangerous adventure and she goes out on her own. Some people are freaking out like, oh my God, why would you leave your kids? Well, why would you take your kids out on a journey like you that? Gotta think, you gotta think it's the story of what they're gonna do in the Rick movies. They're going to have Rick come back to Alexandria, we're hoping, unless they do the comic book I, one. I, you know, I, I doubt don't, it. I don't, so I believe that they will not kill Michonne off simply because the fans desperately want to see Michonne reunited with Rick. Right. And, and Rick come home at the end of the third Rick movie. Yeah. Meaning he's reunited with Daryl. Right. Which is the second person and second most person I want him to be reunited with. To see his daughter and to see his son. If they kill her off, then we don't get that amazing mm -hmm. TV moment. And right. I, I, I truly think that they want it. They they would love to give that to the fans. Yeah, and you know, because I think we've mentioned too. There, there's so many different avenues this could go. We have um, we have Negan who can men now. Well, see, I make this because there has to be some notion of a man with a wound to the side. There also Negan, has to be yeah, yeah. There has to be some proof that yeah. makes Michonne believe that it is dangerous enough for her to leave her kids. Yeah. To go find Rick. Yeah. Meaning she knows Rick's alive. Now, Negan has only seen a helicopter from Jadis. That's all she knows. She has He has no idea about Rick. Same, Similar to Father Gabriel, he knows that some that she that she was up to something. Now, some fans have said maybe Pollyanna McIntosh, Jadis, Returns. would return, say something, and then go back out. 
I don't really see that. Because why? See that why would she return? I mean, if, if she really wanted to be the better person, would she travel back to tell Michonne and then invite her to come to CRM? But I don't know. But here's the deal with that: if Jadis comes back, she's coming back in a helicopter. Then mm-hmm. that means they can just whisk Michonne off in a helicopter, and right. I don't think they're going to do that. That's no. not how they're going to do that. They, they won't need do that again. something that will play out in the long term because yes. Michonne's leaving, mm-hmm. and they w- maybe open it up for the possibility of her going to the Rick movies. Right, um, and that is a long journey to go find him. Yeah, um, yeah. and I and I I just I don't know. I think that that would be the best story and best exit for Michonne. Yeah, and and I also have, uh, kind of going off of that to where you mentioned maybe Maggie, if they hear something of a man, you know, being injured. You know, if if Maggie doesn't come back that way, maybe we get introduced to some character who was just passing by and saw this. <laughs> I don't know. So, but that doesn't really make sense either. My but. theory is that Georgie knows someone from CRM that has given this information on because we know that CRM doesn't take in new people. Well, okay? the CRM that we know of. Correct. But, Jadis but, and from Fear. But this would be a significant event if they took in someone like mm-hmm. Rick that right. was wounded because right. they don't normally do that. Mm-hmm. So this would be something that would be probably well known among the CRM folks right. community. And maybe Georgie stumbled upon and Maggie during their travels, someone that knows that information. Because see, all we know from what they've given us is, yes, yeah, CRM and their logo means three civilizations. But we don't know about all the maybe tiny little organis- outposts that they have. Yeah. Uh, another commenter mentioned maybe a, kind of a cool theory. may do a video on it later. But I've always thought since Jadis and the Heapsters had a helipad, maybe they were technically kind of a branch. But we don't know if Jadis' people knew the secret or if it was just Jadis that knew about the helipad, had the cans that had the CRM logo on it. So there could be other outposts that, like, maybe Maggie and, and Georgie yeah. have come across, and they've heard stories. Like, uh, they come across something, oh, yeah, like, we were recently in this area. Uh, we picked up a guy. He was very hurt. Um, you know, uh, I don't know how they would describe Rick without saying Rick to where it would ding, ding, ding yeah, to Maggie. I don't know. I you know? You know, if... <laughs> honestly, honestly, for, for Michonne to have proof, it would almost need to be Maggie saying, look, Rick, right. Rick is alive. Rick is in this community. Uh, but then again, if if Maggie knew it was exact, my theory is that Maggie doesn't know who that gentleman is. Mm-hmm. But Maggie, but Maggie does know that Rick potentially died. Oh, yeah. She was there. Yeah. 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 So she would connect Riverbank to uh, poss- maybe Riverbank. They'd say floating zombies in the water. She'd be like, oh, okay, maybe, you know. Uh, they did mention, there There was a quick mention of his wound when he was up at the bridge, I thought. Because they were down in the embankment. They saw that he was wounded. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So they know of that wound. Yeah. Another one that uh, I thought of was maybe they will tie in uh, the radio, the woman on the radio. Um, I know a lot of people keep, you know, thinking it may be the Commonwealth story. From what we've heard from the showrunners, I don't, they're not doing that. You know, and they may change their mind, but from what we know so far, they say mm-hmm. they're not doing the Commonwealth in quotes. It could be a different yeah. ab- habitation of it, but not true Commonwealth from the comic books. So it could be maybe the Radio Woman. I don't know. Yeah, I just. But how would she yeah. say that over the radio? You know. Yeah. Oh, hey, we yeah we had some. Uh, like Eugene, you'd be like, "Oh yeah, we're from here," and uh, they'd be like, "Oh yeah, we just, uh, I just, we, we, some people flew in some guy from that area. He had a wound to his side. He was blabbering yeah. about whatever." <laughs> I just, I, 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 I think it would be an amazing movie if we have not just Rick's side of him trying to get to get back to the community, but Michonne's side trying to get back to him, mm-hmm. and you could go between both characters and their journey on trying to find each other. Yeah, I think that'd be an amazing story. But again, I. I have no evidence that they'll do it in any way like this. Yeah, no clue. I mean, if you guys, you know, don't like, if you know any information, you know, please hold off from spoiling in the comments. You know, put a spoiler tag on there just in case for people. I don't think but, anyone's going to know. You know, I mean, well, they haven't released anything on it. With some of these sites like Spoiling Dead Fans, I mean, these people, they, they know some stuff. 
I mean, they. I, I don't know if it's people that like you know that work with The Walking Dead. They see the scripts. They, you know, things get leaked, and I don't know how yeah. it all works. But well, you know, I. Hey guys, you know, this is a community. I welcome you to voice your opinion. Am yeah. I full of crap here? Poke holes in my theory. <laughs> let me know. Let us know the many um, theories that we ramble. Hey, on about. if you got something better, let us know because we definitely like to discuss it amongst ourselves and even do a video. It's going to be huge, guys. Yeah, this is going to be a big moment. We've lost. Some big characters in The Walking Dead. Rick, one of them. And Michonne now leaving. That's huge. Yeah. That's really huge. So let us know in the comments your thoughts. Do you agree with Josh's theory that Maggie and Georgie might possibly have some information to bring back to Michonne when Maggie returns? Or is it the radio? Is it Jadis? Is it just a bystander? Who knows how we're going to find this out. Let us know. Feel free to subscribe, hit the bell, make sure you smash the like button to show your support. It truly helps us out and we really appreciate it. Stay tuned for more. I'm Jarrell. I'm Josh. We're Nocturnation. We're out. We're out.